Hi everyone, I'm going to be drawing on what's my iPad, sorry if you can see my light, uh, I'm on my sofa, so I'm really sorry. Um, as soon as I unlock my iPad, this is my lock screen, that is an Australian police car, so I don't have an Australia. Then to get to the control center now, on iOS 12 on the iPad, just like that. It's like the iPhone X, basically. I hate that. You used to have the iOS 12 beta on my iPad, but then I had to downgrade, so... I was having issues, and then I was used to iOS 11 on my iPad, which was iOS 11.4.1. I just laid everything, which I didn't mind doing. So either like that, or have the issues and wait until I saw it for early, so I was like, I'm deleting everything. And then I unlock my iPad, and it has Touch ID. Then on my home screen, I have camera, camera, I have camera, clock, App Store, Photos, Gmail, from a doc, I've, I've no idea what those apps are called. Because I don't have names. They use have naming, but I've got rid of it. So I have to open on one button. That's Measure Safari set Settings. I have to have a look what that's called. Um, Colorgram. Facebook. Color Number. That wasn't it. Colorify. What that's called? Color therapy. So I have to open up apps to say their names. One, double tap. Coloring book for me. Facebook Messenger, I'm not gonna open that. Um calendar, no that's called. Coloring life. There's a little separator. Um Gumtree, emails and my YouTube. I don't have any personal emails. I don't mind if you have a look at these. These are just my emails. Are basically just junk mail at this point. Junk mail. But don't contact me on my email. It's creepy. Then I have find friends, find friends, find my iPhone, Apple support, Geekbench 4, Instagram, Google Chrome, Gumtree, Silly Short, Silly Short, Silly Shortcuts. Countdown app, Google Earth, Pinterest, and eBay. And then my next page, I have a. I'm not what that is. Gtastic. I like that. So, if you'd see that, that's only what it was. Then I have Bomb Weather, which is Bureau of Meteorology. You can only. Weather. You can only get that app in Australia. So, if you live outside Australia, Australia and you want to download the app, sadly, it won't work. An Australian exclusive app. I'm really sorry. The other. Weather apps and app store. This folder, which is basically by itself, is notes. Then I have Kardashian. I've been playing that a little bit. And a clock. If you're wondering, why is clock spelt wrong? It's normally spelled to the C. It might have been because there are so many clock apps and app store that it's still with a K. So, it might have been why. I don't know. There's nothing private on here if you're wondering. It's just time. Time. that like, just tells you the time and other places. Then I have Ukula speed test. I can do speed test if you want. You can see how fast my internet is or how slow my internet is. Let's have a look. See, I'm gonna plug my iPad. Just, so, I can sit over here away from the light. Ugh, that's a bit better. Sorry about that. Ugh, no, it's not any better. <laughs> Only if my light wasn't in this position. And if it was more near the back door, it would have been better. Let's have a look. So it's taking a while. Uh, it's my internet. It's an app. Yeah, I have crap internet in comparison to other people. The other page I have Swift Playground. Swift Playgrounds. Uh, Swift Playgrounds, which I haven't used in months. And months now. This is why I originally got to iPad for coding. No. I still want to learn another code, but I have other shit on my mind. So like, which I do have other shit on my mind. Um, look, kids, if don't listen to this. There's rude words. Um, and here's a rainbow key, which is basically a rainbow keyboard. And then Grammarly keyboard. Then I have YouTube. YouTube and music. And then criminal case. And that's pretty much it. Um, I love Australian police cars. Let's sit in one. Um, not recently, but a few Sundays ago. I, 
and I enjoyed it. I went to my local PlayStation. I'm not going to tell you what world is for safety safety reasons, but um, I got to go there with like Kayla, and um, and I enjoyed it a lot. So I can't see my face. I can't switch it, which is so annoying. I might have my iPad turned on still. Actually, see if something nice to look at while I'm talking. Then um, my Kayla talked to a police officer and um then um he was really nice and I got to um sit in the police car police car and um put, press the big alert button and that made the sirens go off and that was so cool. And the police officer so said sometimes when I can go for a drive in a police car but Mikhail has to organise it. Michaela was trying to organise it last weekend, but the police were very, very busy. So I couldn't go last weekend. I can't go next weekend because of, um, the... What's the word? Because of, um... Let's have a look at it. Oh, I can't because it's on Facebook. Um, because the Kayla's going, going away to a place called Wagga Wagga. So, um, so she won't be available. Hopefully sometime soon though, I better go for driving a police car and um she can sort it out. I might send her a text message in a bit and see, ask her if something she can organise it sometime next week. Um, because I do want to go for one, but go for a drive in a police car, I think that'd be a good idea. Um, because like, I would enjoy it. Well, I have to confess something. It's something I do in my mum's car sometimes when I sit in the back seat. I sometimes I'm stuck wearing my seat belt, even though, even though it is the law in Australia. It is one of the laws in Australia to do with cars. Uh huh. You can't drink and drive. You can't smoke with kids in the car. I think that became a law when I was in primary school. It wasn't a law for a long while. And then when I was in primary school, they made it, the government made it illegal to smoke with kids in the car. I think maybe, oh, what, uh, I can't tell you what year I was in at school, in primary school. Then you can't text and drive, it's always been illegal. Um, you can't, ha- you, I don't have another phone to prove, whatever. Um, you can't have your phone up to your ear and um, talk on the phone. While driving, you can't do that. That's illegal. Like, you'd lo- get a big fine and lose the merit points. And then maybe, if, like, once you lose all of your demerit points in Australia on your driver's license, you lose it, your driver's license. Then you have to, I have no idea what happens after that because I've never had a driver's license and I've never lost it because I've never had one. But, if I ever do get a driver's license, I'll try not to lose my develop points. Um, if, I ever get, if I do get my driver's, li- driver's license, I would never speed. Never. Hell no. I'd never speed. I would never drink and drive. I would never do anything stupid. I'd always have my seatbelt, obviously, since it is law. And I would all, even though they are uncomfortable, I'd still wear it. And, yeah, I'm not doing anything dumb. That's all my passion is. Wear your seatbelt. Same if like, oh no, it's uncomfortable. Wear it. I do not want to get a fine. I do not want to get a big fine. Because that would not be funny. But, yeah, I enjoyed going, seeing in the police car though. It was awesome. Oh my god. You know, almost sit in a police car, um, call people to the police station and ask, um, them I let you. <laughs> or just walk into your local police station and ask, because that is what I, I did. I didn't go in and ask. I originally called them up, but I'm story so about that. Well, I called them up during the day. I was at a place for fighting chance. I'm not to tell you where that is for safe reasons, but... I went there and I call. I had my phone on loudspeaker, my iPhone on, on loudspeaker when I called the, the my local the local police station, and um, <coughs> pardon me, and um, I talked and um, was a woman that answered, and I talked and um, I had my phone on loudspeaker. I just needed to st- stuff it up. I could have handed it over to one of the um, 
by any chance staff members on the phone over and then they could have talked and um I was nervous as well for at least a goddamn while. I was nervous. And then um my mum's friend, can't tell her name for safe reasons, but she um me- I told her I got over my over my nerves and I don't said, Oh, what did you get over your nerves about or whatever? I said, Oh, that's irresponsible of you. What the f- fuck? It's not but what the fuck? Excuse my language, but what I c- come on. Like, that isn't right. And then I burst out crying. I took my brother's apartment. And I was crying. I was born out. I was tired. I was overtired. I was stressed. I didn't say dressed, if you're honest. I said I'm stressed. And, and I was, was like, I was, I was like, what the hell? Why did you say that to me, you crazy bitch? Like, come on, she is one. I really swear in my videos. Really, but I'm putting a point. That it's, it, is, it isn't right. It isn't right what she said. I'm going to tell her next time not to say these things to me. And then... I didn't want to see her for at least a good few days. I didn't want to text her. I didn't want to call her. I was like, F U B, the B word. Leave me alone. Just leave me alone. So I was saying in my head, I don't want to see you for at least a long while until you clean up your act. But I eventually uh, forgave her. And um, she thought it was for a bad reason. I didn't go to my pl- local police station for a bad reason. I've already... I've... I know reasons why to. I haven't seen any robberies recently. I haven't seen anything bad happen recently near around me. I've never been sexually abused or assaulted. I've never been raped, which is actually good. Um, But... Seriously... But then I did get to go to the police station on the Sunday, which was good. So, it wasn't last Sunday. It was like a few Sundays ago. And, um, and I enjoyed it a lot. Sorry, I'm still going to message. I'll put back on the home screen so you have something nice to look at. And, um, yeah, but then um, last Friday, I was sorry to tell you about the same friend. Well, mum's friend came over, yada yada. I, I, I want to take my nails down for my auntie. I'll show you my toenails. There's my toenails. Colors I decided, color I decided to get. Anywho. And, um, well... And then after that, I came home. I was on my iPad. And then mum's friend decided to... Pull up my iPad, which wasn't found me. Wait a second. Wait a second. Sorry, everybody, about that. Wait a second. It's not going to settings. You can have it with me. Do a backup. And um, let's see a second. People. Hmm. I don't think else look at that's of any interest to me. Put some social dates. Do I? Anyways, I'll say it. I'll whisper. And um, oh wait. Please wait. Right. Yeah. No, no, no dates. It's just good. Updates. Yep. Oh my god, it's on. Um, let's not look at that. That's my iPad storage. Wow, nearly out of space. That's so nice. Let's
I'll try and start in a second. Stop watching it come handy. Any odds? Not really. I don't use arm, but anything like this. Okay, access could come handy. God, I can't see what I'm doing. <laughs> That's funny. 